So welcome back, part four of your Everyday Hero Meditation Challenge. We are um, going back to our first meditation. So days one to three, the meditation that you started, outlining the kind of basics of creative meditation. We're going to go back now and experience the difference now that you've gone into your breath, your um, concentration and visualization and awareness and see how much you've grown in the last nine days you know since you um since you started actually your mental faculty in your brain is going to be um able to receive and interpret um the meditation in a far deeper way now so um going back to days one and three don't feel like you're going back you're just going in deeper and then from then we'll move on to taking the meditation a little further so enjoy namaste okay so grounding through your sits bones if you're sitting grounding through your feet if you're on a chair lengthening the crown up nice and tall turn your palms down onto your knees and let's close our eyes soft focus for those of you who get spacey very quickly otherwise we close our eyes for those of you who get distracted very easily and we're going to first of all take a couple of deep breaths breathing in and out fully inhale deeply exhale completely lengthening with the inhale reaching the crown up a little taller and exhale deeper rooting with that exhale and growing with your inhale scanning your body seeing where you're at dis-ease maybe shuffling adjusting maybe rolling those shoulders opening across the chest a little bit and then just watching your breath come in and out through your nose see if you can lengthen up your breath a little see if you can even out the inhale and the exhale see if you can let yourself go with the exhale see if you can aspire upwards with the inhale whatever's in the way let go of it with the inhale aspire upwards with the exhale ground let go with the inhale open up grow and as you just let that breath come in and out allowing it to become equal feel the natural balance that you're creating internally As we regulate our breath, we start to regulate our etheric system, that is our energetic makeup. And with the next exhale, see if you can bring a visualization in with the breath. So exhale down through the base of the sits bones or down through the spine visualizing roots starting to grow into the earth beneath you inhale draw in nourishment drawing support up through those roots and exhale back down through the spine and grow those roots a little deeper inhale rising the crown reaching up aspiring to know 
exhale down through the spine down through the sits bones down through the spine root yourself a little deeper remember you can only grow as deep as your roots are on your next inhale draw in the nourishment draw in the support that you need through this day through this time and grow as high as your creative imagination can grow you growing branches up into the sky reaching up into the fresh breeze above you and then exhale back down through those branches down through your spine and into those roots again back up and down through the trunk of your tree creating those branches growing those branches up see if you can grow them above the um, clouds above you and exhale grow those roots down deeper if you are going to live your purpose in this lifetime on this planet you need to be well rooted you need to be taking in all the support that you can right now. You need to be grounded in your very fabric of who you are, what life is physically. And you need to be connected upwards to the life that permeates every atom in every cell in your body. So as your branches reach above the um, clouds, feel the sunlight, the light that is able now to come down into your head center. And just be open to receiving this morning open to knowing all that you have to know this morning get all of your stuff out the way all of your agenda out the way and just open up to knowing what you have to know receiving what you have to receive Feeling those branches growing wider as you lift up higher into the brightest sun of life. And down through the spine, draw that light through every part of your body, down even into the roots. Turning your palms upwards now maybe thumb and first finger together or just palms up in a receiving gesture shoulders draw back a little bit as we focus now in our heart center still keeping in our peripheral imagination the um, visualized tree that is our life and feeling that heart magnetic force feeling how as you focus on your heart you can feel this uh, vibration of attraction this is your magnet This magnet draws what we need to us, draws the people to us through the magnetic force of love that unifies. So into your heart center, feel that magnetic force. 
This is one way that your everyday hero communicates with you through this attractive quality that draws people to you that you need to learn from, need to grow from, need to work with, need to share with, need to teach, need to grow. And then visualizing all the other magnetic heroes of the world. That is all the individuals on this planet right now. I'm feeling a connection you have with all of them. Now some that attraction is stronger and some it is weaker. But whatever the um, strength, just sending and receiving love through these connections. Feeling part of an interconnected web of life. Your heart is the king of your emotions. If we allow past emotions to color this center, we can't feel this magnetic pulse. So breathing into your heart center and exhale, letting go of anything that's in your way, fully feeling. Fully feeling your emotional guidance system of your heart of this magnetic force that is guiding us through a feeling. And as we let go, we ask to feel all that we have to feel. and to know all that we have to know. And into our core, into our gut, where this knowingness and this feelingness acts, where it's digested, transmuted, and an action is created in form. Feel what's going on there and exhale, let go. Whatever's blocking you from taking action. Inhale, breathing in strength, power, creative will into the center. This is where the magician works on the physical plane. This is things we create in our life. We all as everyday heroes need to be visionary. We need to have empathy. We need to feel the world around us. And we need to have drive in order to take action, to put ourselves out there, to make um, ourselves heard, express fully. Requires a little bit of self-belief, self-esteem. And then through these centers, our gut, our heart, and our head. Breathing all the way through them and then back down them. Each one of us has a strong point. Some of us are very insightful, very wise, but there's no grounded in it, the groundedness in it. Some of us are very empathetic. 
sensitive. But we don't know what to do with it. We feel it too much. It becomes us. It takes hold of us. We don't let it flow through our receivers and be gone. And some of us are all about action, but we don't check in with our higher faculties before doing. We don't check in with our sensitivities before we do. So whichever center is your strong point, just drawing some of that strength down into the other two or out into the other two. Knowing all we have to know, feeling all we have to feel and being all that we are. From the base of our spine, up to our crown, receiving the pearls of wisdom, the insight that we need right now, and drawing it down through head, through heart, and into your core, into your gut. Rooting it down through sits bones, through spine, down into the ground. And come back to your original flow of breath through the roots all the way up to your branches and back down. Making a mental note right now, this visualization for the hours ahead the day ahead of us until we next meditate. That connection downwards, that connection upwards, that connection from our heart outwards. It's like the symbol of that equal armed cross that we keep with us in our daily lives. Keep the connections up and down, in and out, and from ourselves to others. From the highest point of light you can creatively imagine, draw down into your head center and out to all others on this planet. Letting light flow, letting wisdom flow, letting knowingness open up new realities. And from the greatest magnetic force that you can creatively imagine, allow love to flow from your heart to all the other hearts on this planet, all the other magnetic centers across this earth. And from the greatest sense of will, power, into your gut, into your um, core. Let that empowerment fuel you to do some real magic to all those other creators, those other magicians across the world, those other everyday heroes around this earth, sending them that will, that will to good, that good will feeling, to create a better future for all of us and for this planet. Drawing in through our crown, drawing in from our roots, feeling the whole of who you are, your cosmic individualized egg, connected through those three centers to all that is. Breathing in and breathing out. Breathing in and breathing out.
Sounding OM three times to finish our practice, taking an inhale and exhale. You can visualize them in each, in each three of the centers or just feel the vibration through the whole of your being. Take an inhale and exhale. And inhale for three ohms. Oh. Receiving what you have to receive, turn your palms down onto your knees, give your legs a little rub and come back into your room, come back into your body, your five senses, the feeling of your hands on your legs, the slight sounds of the world around you, the smells, the tastes and then subtly opening your eyes, maybe rub your hands and just um, rubbing your face, you know, from the brow across to the temples, three times, just waking up this highest faculty for the day ahead. Let's use our sixth sense today, hey? So namaste, have a great day ahead. I hope the meditation helps you through all the flows of emotions and the craziness of the thoughts and our news feeds and the news around us as your day happens. I hope you get creative, give yourself some time, pens and papers and paintbrushes, mud, sticks, whatever it is that's creative for you. Make a song, make a poem. Use this time and space for your creativity to flow. And we'll see you in three days time for the next meditation. Good luck, keep it up. This is an exciting time for us all. So keep going.